G'day guys, it's Steve here from the Greg Chapel Cricket Centre and our mates at Grainicles down in Melbourne have sent us up a few pre-production bats that we're going to take a look at. So this is just going to be a quick preview. I mean, you had a full review leading into the season um, and that's because this bat could change a little bit. So our, this is our preview model uh, and watch our full review later in the year to have our full model um, that will update any changes. Now this is the grand, brand new Grey Nichols Atomic and it looks pretty sweet. Now starting from the top it's got this new Grey Nichols link grip, uh, looks a bit like a half chain link. Chain link. Uh, now if you've ever had a scale grip just imagine half the scales turned upside down and it feels pretty good. Uh, inside that grip is the Grey Nichols semi -oval, oval handle, one of the best in the business and it's in all their bats. Now moving further down is where things get a bit more rock and roll. Now as you can see a pretty serious edge here um, and a hugely full profile. So not a little bit of scalloping there, full all the way from the edges to the spine and it's, uh, it's a pretty forgiving looking bat. Now we like this bat because it's designed uh, a little bit of everything. So rather than having a super low or super high middle, it's designed to do a bit of it all. And uh, one way it's done that is to extend its center or its sweet spot further up and down the blade. One, one way it's done that is by uh, offsetting the spine of the bat or the edges, depends which way you want to say it. Uh, so what that means is that the edges peak here and the spine of the cricket bat peaks a bit further up the blade and that extends your hitting zone and your best possible sweet spot further up the bat also makes it nice and balanced. So Grey Nichols haven't stopped there. Uh, another way they've extended the sweet spot is not always by length but by width. So this bat has a flat face in it um, which means you've got a bit of a wider sweet spot and it's going to cannon off. So I'm going to give it a tap now and show you what we're dealing with. So as you can hear, that really high ping of this 1400 model is pretty serious. And it hangs on to it lower down the blade. Now, we're excited for this bat. Um, it might change a little bit leading in, leading in the next season, but the small amount of preview stock we have uh, are all gonna be like this.